The involvement of the X-plane with NGAD would be unique, as experimental aircraft are generally used to explore new technologies that have not previously been used on an airborne platform, whereas the term, Y-plane, is generally a prototype of a particular platform. With some refinement, the aircraft could go into production. However, it is known that the Department of Defense DOD, selected the Lockheed Martin the 1035 at the end of the X-plane competition with Boeing's X-32. The X-plane explored the combination of supersonic flight with short takeoff and vertical landing capabilities and stealth technology, as well as new manufacturing techniques. Perhaps the X marks a new turning point in fighter development. More than one plane. NGAD is also not just one plane. Described as a family of systems, the goal of NGAD, which originated in a 2014 DARPA, Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, Air Dominance Initiative study, is to field a new sixth-generation fighter by the 2030s to replace the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor. The Air Force estimates that the NGAD program could cost $11.7 billion from 2024 to 2027. It would be one of the Air Force's most expensive programs to date. NGAD would include a number of manned and unmanned systems. A variety of multi-mission drones, dubbed Collaborative Combat Aircraft, CCAs, could act as loyal wingmen to manned NGAD fighters. As reported by Air and Space Forces, the CCA builds on progress made by the Pentagon and other partners, including the U.S. Air Force's Skyborg program. DARPA's Air Combat Evolution Program, and aviation giant Boeing's work with Australia on the MQ-28 Ghostbat. All of those gathered convinced me that we are ready to commit to this kind of capability, Kendall said. He further described the CCA as one of the most important programs awaiting funding. The program is scheduled to receive $5.8 billion over the next five years. Production would begin at the end of the five-year cycle, around fiscal year 2028. It was also noted that the CCA program is not part of the NGAD platform source selection. Kendall has said that NGAD and CCA will be developed, in parallel, but he declined to say when the contract for the CCA program would be awarded.